ChurchBot started week two fairly slowly. This week being midterms, stress was in the air, and so attendance suffered from the beginning of the week. The programmers had a midterm project on robotics, so our attendance didn't lack. We created a fully functional scouting program, code for the tank drive, and virtual interactive fields. The mechanics and electrical crews came in starting Thursday afternoon when midterms were over. At that point, we completed a rolling chassis, tested it, and began working on an intake system. Friday, our most productive and last day, many people showed up before the blizzard. We completed the intake system, integrated it with the chassis, and now we're starting on a shooter mechanism, one very much more advanced than our crew design last week. Our robot design for now is a low bar design, meaning we are restricted to 15 inches high to get under the obstacle. This is a great challenge because not only do our parts need to be small, but our electrical system and motors need to be space efficient. As the robot work is being done, a new team member, Chris, is building a battery box and other miscellaneous items we may need for the competition. A job just as important to the success of the team as the robot itself. When he is done, he among three other members will start to build mock field components to practice driving over and start accuracy, accuracy tests for shooting. See you next week!